coming into the weekend. It was Boemi with a 10-point advantage, but a lot can happen in a day. We can go from hell to heaven or heaven to hell in one lap. We can never be sure the weekend is a good one until it's over. He's in the wall! Sebastian Boemi, wow. championship leader, out of the second free practice session. That's a big one for Boemi. We have to rebuild a full car, and we have five hours to do so. And these things happen. It happened to me in Hong Kong. It could happen to anyone. Whatever happens uh, outside of what we can influence, it's really not up to us, so we don't care. Bit of a big knock to your head. Were you OK? Did you hurt yourself at all? No, it was a big hit, but no, no I'm fine. Just trying to do my best now in qualifying, but it's not uh, looking so good. Did you know that Sebastian Bremi has a 10 place grid penalty due to the work that's being done on his car? Uh, no, I didn't know that. Here comes Buemi, neat and tidy. Where is this going to put the championship leader? He cuts the timing beam and Buemi goes quickest. 1 minute 23, <laughs> 0.053. <laughs> Lucas Degrassi, he needs to be there or thereabout. Here he comes across the line and he's quicker. 1 minute 23, 0.026. Wow, what a lap from Lucas Degrassi. He has the upper hand now, so I just need to focus on trying to, to push as hard as I can to, to, to get as many points as possible. Perfect lap, perfect lap. That's just the job one of part one. Sebastian Buemi, who's starting there, down in 12th place with just two races to go. All five lights are on, and we go green in Montreal, and it's a good start from Sarazan, but Degrassi comes over and covers it nicely. Buemi side by side with the Andretti car of Antonio Felix da Costa on the run of into towards turn two. He's been passed by both Andretti's, gets a bash from this side, a bash from that side. Too cautious, he's an attacking driver, and he's just been a little too careful. Here Here's comes Buemi. Buemi, now he's managed to get past Maro Engel then. The look up Heidfeld up the inside is closing, closing. You're Sebastian oh, Buemi again on this. This is for one point in the championship. Lucas Degrassi changing over into his second car. That slows down to go into the box. Ale! Buemi shouting yes. Ale on the radio. That's moving off. Go. And here, oh, he's coming oh, in front he? of Daniel Ale now. Oh, and he's oh. in there. He vient de rentrer dans Express, le plus fort cielo. He's absolutely furious. Oh, here comes Buemi on the inside and he's through into third place, but Sarazan's holding it on around the outside. Careful and then we've contact. Buemi's heading towards the barrier, just about keeps it out. It's victory wow. for Lucas Degrassi here in Montreal. I think Seb's just lost it. Oh, and he's furious races, with Antonio yeah. Felix da Costa here. You, what, you dive in like you... What should I do? It's from behind or what? No! This is like a reality TV show. But the show then took another twist. After the race, Boemi's second car was found to be underweight and he was disqualified from the results.